Okay, so besides uh, Anyran, there is also a website called uh, Hybrid Analysis, uh, and it works similarly to the uh, Anyran, uh, Anyran uh, website. Um, as you can see here, we, uh, I'm on the main page um, of a file. In this case, it's oh, well, I'm not run somewhere xd.exe, um, and uh, it can be searched uh, searched by uh, searching the uh, hash of the file uh, in the search box. Mm, here, if we, if we scroll down uh, a, a little bit, uh, we can also see the uh, antivirus results uh, of scanning this uh, this file. As you can see, they're really high because it's a, it is a WannaCry ransomware, so um, a known ransomware in the cybersecurity industry. Um, then we can see the related hashes uh, and it will search uh, this file if you will um, place any of these hashes in the, uh, into the search box. Um, we can also see the uh, sandboxes, uh, the reports from the sandboxes um, that were uh, run uh, on, this, uh, on this website. Um, and I will now, uh, for this demo, uh, pick this uh, this sandbox that was uh, analyzed on uh, 2020 um, in December 2020. Um, let's open this one, and what we will see uh, we'll see obviously the result. What is what was the threat score um, and the, the uh, antivirus detection uh, rate. Um, in some cases, you can download it itself, but I do not recommend it because it's an, um, a real uh, ransomware file. Um, let's scroll down to the bottom. Uh, here we can see um, what uh, MITRE attack uh, tactics uh, this file was using. We can also download it as a CSV file. Uh, you can analyze uh, the whole um, the whole uh, table uh, and see what was going on uh, after this um, file was launched. Uh, then uh, we can scroll a little bit uh, down. Uh, you can see the indicators uh, that were happening uh, after uh, executing the file. Uh, but what is uh, interesting is that we can go to the file details section uh, and then you can see uh, the metadata, uh, the file compositions, what were the imported objects, uh, and uh, what it contained. In this case, it was a, a C++ uh, code. Uh, let's see also what the, uh, what the file uh, has imported. Uh, so the DLs, DLLs, sorry, um, you can see the list of whole, uh, every DLL that the file has uh, imported. Uh, you can also see the screenshots as well as was with the uh, any run, and also you can see the process tree. Uh, similarly to what we have seen in the any run. Mm. In this case, uh, you can see that the one on the cryptor exe was run. Uh, so th this is another confirmation that we are dealing with the uh, WannaCry uh, ransomware. Uh, down at the bottom, we can see the network analysis. Uh, what were the hosts uh, uh, that th this file was uh, trying to connect? Um, in this case, it, it was the Mm, successful uh, attempts. Uh, we can see also what countries uh, it was connect connecting to uh, and from. We can also see what were these extra strings. Uh, here in the all strings, uh, some people use it also to perform uh, malware analysis. Uh, it is all uh, up to you. You can see the extracted files uh, from that executable. Uh, with uh, the hashes of those. Uh, and you can also see uh, the comments uh, of the 
community that was um, that is signed in to the hybrid analysis uh, web website. Uh, if you will be logged, you can also uh, add your own comments uh, and uh, add some value to the hybrid analysis uh, community.